Okay, this is the second part of the shadow box tutorial. And you will notice that you have a box, um, a little um, box that fits over each window on your face frame of your shadow box. So our goal in this part of the tutorial is to get all of these pieces glued down to the face frame from the inside of the box. So I'm gonna take each of these off and just set them aside. And we're gonna start one by one gluing these down. And I'll probably do a couple of them on the video, and then I will probably pause, and we can all work on that on our own. So you have to watch me the whole time. I'm going to go ahead and put some glue on all four sides of this little box. Kind of rubbing that around just a little so it really gets spread across the head. Okay, I'm going to flip that over and it should perfectly line up with one of the holes on that face frame. And I'm going to just glue that right into place. And I'm gonna push down on each of those tabs on all four sides. So what, basically what you're doing is you're going to create these nice windows that look through on your shadow box. And we are working from the inside where all the seams and things will be. And you won't see any of that from the outside of the box. But you're gonna to wanna to make sure you take your time and do a really neat job on this so that you end up with a beautiful project, project at the very end. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and work on my second piece here. Whoa. Okay. I'm going to try and leave that kind of upside down. So I don't have to wait for the glue so long. Okay, on the second piece, we're going to go ahead and line that right up with its opening and glue it down. Now I've created these little glue flaps where they should not overlap the next window. They should just stay inside that. So if you can see that it's overlapping a little, then you've, you're not centered exactly where you need to be. Going ahead all the way around this box and pushing everything down and into place. The pieces in between these two boxes are going to be a little bit challenging. And in fact, you might need to grab like little something just to kind of help you push down. Make sure that glue gets really well adhered. You don't want this box falling apart. Now, you'll notice that these two flaps are overlapping just a little bit. Before you apply adhere the back of the shadow box on, you're going to want to go through and glue those flaps together so that everything is stuck down really well. I'm not going to do that yet though because I might need some wiggle room between now and then, putting things together. But I wanted to mention it so that you don't forget to do that. Okay. All right, we are putting our next small window in place. These really fit in here just really nicely. these scissors to push down on these seams in here that are in between. Okay, hold that down nice and tight. Like I said, if you're um, new to putting these types of projects together, you might want to start on a little bit easier three-dimensional project. This is just a little bit advanced, so you can always flip it over and kind of check where if things are lining up. Make sure that things look good to you. Okay, I am going to pause the video and go ahead and put the next three in place, and then I will 
show you in the next segment how to finish off this box.